Welcome to the CauseList tutorial. In this video, I will show you three key features of CauseList application. One, how to take printout of a cause list for a given day. Two, how to record the orders for the day. Three, add next date for the cases. On the top with the cause list is shown the number of listed matters today. Cause list application organizes your hearings by quotes. Initially, all quotes are selected. If you wish to remove any code before taking print, just click. Click again to bring back. It also shows how many cases are listed in each code. Select date for which you want cause list either by scrolling left or right button or use calendar. Click printer icon button. This will show you neatly formatted cause list ready to be printed. Now let's see how to record the order given by the code for a given case. Click on the case. Click on the day where you want to add or update the order's detail. Update the order and click update. Usually we also receive the next date along with the order. If so, you may click save and add more to record the next date. Now let's explore few additional features of cause list application. If you wish to see longer history of the case, click more dates. If you want to add another date related to the case, click add event. To go directly to the case in my office, click go to case. Thanks for watching. If you have doubts, please write comments below or write us at social at webbarrister.com.